three fires in less than a month, probably closer to three weeks, but less than a month. It kind of makes you a little uneasy. <laughs> it started February 9th when a fire started in the Randa Street home. Owner had passed away about a year and a half ago. They were just starting remodeling and apparently getting pretty close to finished. Five days later, the house caught fire again. It's very unnerving because uh, being my wife disabled and it was a, it's a large fire and it, it burned for about maybe six to eight hours. Fast forward to a week later, Bernetta Jackson was fast asleep when her SUV caught fire. I mean, I barely stepped out the door and it started pop, pop, pop. Neighbors called the fire department. My wife looked out the window. She said, oh, the car is on fire. And I looked out there and I heard a big boom, you know, like a James Bond thing. There is nothing left of the car, but you can see the damage to Jackson's home. We lost the gutters from the heat. Fire officials say neighbors reported that during two of the fires, a suspicious person was spotted nearby. And while the close-knit community waits for answers, they continue to keep a watchful eye. We spoke to the Copperas Cove Police Department as well as the Fire Department. The investigation is active and ongoing. In Copperas Cove, Maggie Lowe Miller, Central Texas News Now. All right, Maggie, thank you. Anyone with information is asked to contact Copperas Cove Fire Department. Crime Stoppers pays up to $1,000 for tips that lead to an arrest.